My name is Atar Agarwal. I'm an international student from Mumbai, India, studying at the University of Toronto. In my first year, I also lived in residence, and then I came back this year, knowing that something would be different. Interactions had to be a lot more intentional, whether it be in sunny September or frigid cold February. We still made an attempt to take our meals, layer up, brave the cold, and go out and eat at least one meal a day on the quad. Even though I might be alone, I don't feel lonely. I'm away from home, so I'm alone from family, but I'm not lonely because I have a family away from home, in university, in residence, and beyond. My name is Lena O. Oh. I live in Vancouver, BC, and. I'm a nursing student at the University of British Columbia. After the pandemic, all our lectures have been moved online and our labs have been condensed. So they made us come in into one big lab on one day or two days of the term where we would learn everything together. Because we only had one day and because we couldn't go into the labs for extra practice like we did prior to the pandemic, I lacked in my confidence to um, perform those skills. But because we had the opportunity to go back into our clinical placements and practice what we have learned, um, that really helped me a lot. Even in the midst of the pandemic, me and like other nursing school graduates were really excited about working as professionals. And I'm just hoping that we can be some relief to the nurses who are already there in the front lines. My name is Jeremy and I live in Victoria. I'm 24 years old and I'm a first year master's student at Ritsumeikan APU, which is a university in Beipu, Japan. Hello everybody, welcome to the April 2021 APU entrance ceremony. The Prime Minister of Japan decided to impose an unspecified extension of border restrictions on foreign students. I'm doing my master's degree online, which is exhausting because I have to overcome the 16 hour time difference, which means that I have to take classes usually from 8 p.m. until 4 a.m. My school has basically told me like, okay, you probably have to get ready to do this for a long time. And by a long time, they haven't specified what that means. I had a small mental breakdown. It wasn't anything severe, but I found myself just lacking motivation to get stuff done. But I'm not alone. There are other people around the world in the same situation as well. That's what I've told myself to keep going. Yeah.